Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve the Windows Update Error Code 0x800F024B that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer that reads that an error encountered. There were some problems installing updates, but we'll try again later. If you keep seeing this and want to search the web or contact support for information, this may help and then it'll have the error code. And so this will hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So the first thing we're gonna do is open up the search menu, type in to the search menu, troubleshoot, best match, we're going back with troubleshoot settings. Go ahead and open that up. On the right side, underneath options, you wanna select other troubleshooters. And then underneath most frequent, select the Windows Update Troubleshooter and the corresponding run option. And give that a moment here. And once that is concluded, go ahead and close out of here. Open up the search menu and type in device manager. Best match, I'll come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. If you're having an issue, for example, with like an audio driver, which I have see that this error sometimes is associated with, you would double click on that entry in the list here and then right click on your input or output device, again, whatever the issue pertains to. Right click on it and select update driver. And then you wanna select browse my computer for drivers. And then select, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. If you have a specific one for your manufacturer, I would recommend selecting it and then the next option. Otherwise, you can select the generic one if that's the only option that's available to you. And then select next. Once that's done, go ahead and close out of here. And then you want to open up the search menu and type in CMD. Best match, you'll come back with command prompt. Right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And into this elevated command line window, you want to go ahead and type in SFC, followed by a space, forward slash, scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Once you have it, as you see it on my screen, hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so once that is completed, you can see it did find corrupt files and successfully repaired them. Go ahead and close out of here, and then you want to restart your computer.
so there you go guys hopefully this point issue has been resolved and if you go ahead and proceed to check for updates you should not be having this issue any longer so as always thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial i do hope i was able to help you out and i do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial goodbye